We are in right now the most exciting, dynamic, and scary time for American healthcare that we have ever experienced. The ACA was signed in 2010, and it wasn't the end. It was only an important landmark in the always moving forward evolution of the U.S. healthcare system. The game of health insurance is not what it was prior to the ACA. The emergence of the health insurance exchanges and marketplaces, the elimination of the ability of insurers to enroll people based upon their prior health status, the uh, new forms of competition that are emerging in the market um, create a completely different environment than what has existed before. It is less now about individual patient care and more about what can we do to keep our whole panel of patients healthier and thriving better in the community and needing us less rather than needing us more. What's now becoming more evident is that there are still significant affordability challenges for the American public. The Affordable Care Act, at the end of the day, is not affordable enough to meet all of the challenges of where we need to go as a society in providing decent, affordable, quality health care for everybody. The challenges coming up deal with accelerating the pace of cost control on the system so that the system delivers more and more value. It is how do we continue to improve the quality of services that are delivered? How do we advance the improvement of health of patients outside of the delivery care setting? Those are pieces. And then also, how do we continue to deal with the challenges of getting as many Americans as possible covered by health insurance? president in November 2016, beginning in 2017, is going to be doing some significant course corrections to the direction of health reform. There will be changes coming, so begin to think about the likely directions that the system may go depending upon what happens in November 2016. It's something that's vitally important for people in terms of thinking ahead to come up with an effective way to be able to absorb what matters in their own context, which is broader than they think, and to, um, and to be able to figure out then how to respond to those and prioritize what is going to matter the most to them. The main advice is to stay current. Uh, this, this field, this arena is changing every day.